สวัสดีครับ I'm c a l and this is m a l a Channel Last video we talk about brief story of Muay Thai and Muay Thai b o r a n Today we gonna dig down to root of Muay s h a y a one of recognized Muay b o r a n style. s h a y a is an ancient province in south of Thailand, around 600 km from Bangkok. It's a part of Surat Thani province today. But actually, Muay s h a y a is start in Bangkok. The legend begins in the reign of King Rama III. One of his warriors decided to quit and become a monk to seeking peace and pilgrimage to s h a y a Everyone called him p o t a n m a and he started to teach his Muay Thai style there. One of his students is Prayawaji Satyarak, the governor of s h a y a This unique Muay Thai style rooted in s h a y a since then. In Thailand, it is an old fashion to have music and plays during the funeral. Some said for spiritual reason, some said for recovery people from sorrow. During one of royal family member funeral, beside of other entertainment, the royal palace also announced to all governor in the kingdom to find a good boxer and fight in this event in front of King Rama the Fifth. Raya Waji bring his student Nai Prong j a m n o n g Thong to Bangkok. When the fight day arrive, his opponent is the boxer from North Eastern, Korat. Korat boxer known as very powerful boxer. When they throw punch and kick, that is deadly. When the bell ring. Um, actually, at that time it's a drum. Anyway, suddenly, when the bell ring, n a i p r o n g still do w i d e club. The Muay Thai dance to pay respect to their own teacher, but opponent doesn't want to wait. He throw a kick to p r o n g s neck. p r o n g fall down and pass out. Start bring him down from the ring and wait until he's awake. Let's talk about this a little bit. The old school Muay Thai rule: We not count one to ten. If one boxer knock out, we will bring him down. Wait until he wake up and ask, Does he want to fight again? If yes, he will back to the ring. Also, p r o n g said yes. The second round begin. Now p r o n g know his opponent very strong and aggressive. He start to pretend like he's still dizzy and not well recovery yet. He stagger and left right foot behind. His stand get lower and lower to the stand called s u a l a k h a n He decided to bet with a single move. n a m o y Korat also wait for the right time to finish him in one b r o w When he is in the lane. n a k m o y Korat threw a deadly kick to his head. Suddenly, p l o n g j u m p up, u s e his left arm, lift n a k m o y Korat leg, and right hand strike to the face. n a k m o y Korat fall backward. Then p l o n g u s e his elbow and knees, hit on the upper chest and solar plexus. When n a k m o y Korat on the ground, that is good night move. Plong win the fight, get the title from King Rama the Fifth. m u n m u a i mi shu. The whole kingdom know m u a i Shaya on that day. And now I'm here at Thung k r a m e n or s a n a m Luang today. The space in front of Grand Palace. Can you imagine? The m u a i Shaya legend match is happens here over a hundred years ago. Moishaya passed from Pothanma to Prayawaji. 
a n d Pessimist ยังเจสันปรมาจารย์เขตศรียาภัยโอ a แกลนมาสเตอร์เขตศรียาภัย He learned from his father and also from another 11 teacher include m u a y c h a y a Master who is p o r t a n m a s student and his father's student m u a y Thai boxer and international boxer and when he lived in Bangkok he met p a l a m a j a n Kim s e n g t o v i s i who is a well-known martial art teacher, martial artist, and trainer at that time. Kru Kim s e n g was born in Bangkok in 1890. When he turned 14, his father sent him to Singapore to study there. At that time, he trained Jiu-Jitsu, Judo, Kung Fu, and fencing in the school. And he met Mr. Baker, the bakery owner, but he also a boxer too. Yang Kim Seng trained boxing with him by the national sporting rules. Everything is going well for him. But happiness is short life. One day, in the last year of his school, Kru Kim Seng received the bad news. His mother, injured from tiger attack, on the way back to her house in Pahang, Malaysia, after visit him. The injury was too bad. Doctor cannot do anything. She passed away. Kru Kim Seng decided to resign from the school and return to Thailand. When he stayed at his house in Bangkok, he felt he can't handle this. Then he traveled deep into the jungle in Salaburi province. While he stayed around in the jungle, he g e t sick from fever and starvation. But destiny bring him hiking through a small village in Ayutthaya province and meet Kru Kyo, the Muay Thai master and traditional doctor. Kru Kyo gave him a medical treatment until he recovered. Kru Kim Seng told Kru Kyo about his story, and he had nowhere to go. Then Kru Kyo asked him to stay with him, train Muay Thai, and study about Thai medicine. Kru Kim Seng accepted and lived with Kru Kyo for over two years. During that time, Kru Kim Seng was beloved by Kru Kyo family because he trained and studied hard. And help out the housework, even nursing Kru Kyo when he gets sick, until his last breath. After Kru Kyo passed away, Kru Kim Seng came back to Bangkok. He lived in Yanawa District, not too far from Kru Kyo's house. Kru Kim Seng opened his house as a martial art and boxing gym. Many young men went and trained there. Kru Kyo was 19, young and so confident in his skill. He heard about this teacher. He went to Kru Kim Seng house to observe. One day, Kru Kim Seng instruct his student how to stop the kick with palm block above the attacker knees. Kru Kyo asked loudly, "What if I kick very fast like a wing?" Kru Kim Seng looked at this young man and asked him to try. Kru Kyo walked straight to him and threw a kick. Kru Kim Seng received several kicks, then Kru Kyo punched him in the face. He slightly slipped and pushed Kru Kyo's chin. Kru Kyo fell down to banana tree. Kru Kim Seng walked straight to him, the smile is still on his face, and asked, Is the wind stopped? Kru Kyo waving his hand, Oh, it stopped. Later, Kru Kyo came back to Kru Kim Seng's house again, but this time, with Bowl, flowers, candle, towel, and money six baht. It's a traditional way to ask teacher to accept him as a student. k r u k e t start train under k r u k i m s i n g on that day. k r u k e t combine all knowledge from all of his teacher and pass down to his student. I feel so lucky and such an honor. To train under k r u l e k g r i d a k o n s o t p r a s e r one of k r u k e t direct students. If you're interested to train in his camp, especially with a professional Muay Thai Chaya trainer, 
You can contact to Ban Chang Thai, Moi Chai Ya Camp. We also have an online class for international students. I will put the link in the description. Thank you. Stay tuned. Chaya is an ancient province in south of Thailand. It's a part of Suratani province today. But actually, Moi Chaya is starting in Bangkok. In the reign of King Rama III, one of his warriors decided to quit and become a monk to sit in peace. And he pilgrimed to Chaya. Everyone called him Pao Than Man. And he started to teach his Muay Thai style. One of his students is Raya Waji Satyarak. The governor of Chaya during one of royal family member funeral, Raya Waji bring his student Nai Prong Jam Nong Thong to Bangkok. His opponent is the boxer from Northeastern. Prong win the fight, get the title from King Rama the Fifth. Moon Moi Mi Shu. Moi Chaya passed from Pao Than Man to Raya Waji and passing his younger son, Bandmaster Kiet Si Yapai. He learned from his father and also from another eleven teacher, Palamajan Kim Seng Tu Visi. Kruket combined all knowledge from all of his teachers and passed down to his students. 